Before we continue, I think it's important that I point out um, not everyone's palettes and Adobe Illustrator layouts will look the same. And so you can tweak these and modify them to suit your purposes at any time. And the way to do this is to arrange a workspace. So somewhere in the upper right hand corner in CS6 and probably in almost every version of Adobe Illustrator is this little tab up here. And mine says Map Publisher. And what this is, is you shouldn't say Map Publisher, actually. What this is are different layouts of the tools and palettes that you can use in Adobe Illustrator, depending on what you're doing. So if you're a web designer, there's this default web palette layout, and you'll have the palettes that you're most likely to need for web design here. Printing and proofing, you'll have those palettes. But what you can do is you can create your own palettes. And um, as I showed you in an earlier tutorial, under Window Map Publisher, you'll see that there are all these different palettes that you can actually use. So for example, here's the Map Publisher Attributes palette. Well, one thing I recommend you do is that you rearrange your palettes in a way that you like, and also pull all of these Map Publisher palettes over here. So see here under this Map Publisher workspace, I have Map Views at top, Map Attributes, Map Themes, basically a bunch of the important palettes. I have layers down here, etc. I'm actually going to pull layers up and drop it here, and you'll see why momentarily. And um, once you have it arranged how you like it, you can go up here and you can go New Workspace. And you can give it a name. I'll call this Map Publisher 2 and hit OK. And every time you open your program after this, if if you have it laid out how you like it, you can go up here and select the layout that you like, and it'll be um, it'll be ready. So that's one little tip for for basically before we move on into Map Publisher, knowing where your Map Publisher tools and palettes are, etc. Um, as we move through this, you might find that you're using certain tools more, certain palettes. Feel free to uh, rearrange your workspace and save it so that you can find things quickly 